And though just 140 characters, Donald Trump's tweets are known for causing controversy worldwide. Uh, but last night, as we mentioned there, his verified account was not causing much of anything when it briefly disappeared. CTV's Jamie Morocco has more on this. So, Jamie, give us the details. Well, Lois, for a whole 11 minutes, President Donald Trump couldn't tweet. That's because his Twitter account was shut down. Fans and critics alike who found themselves on the president's account were greeted by this message upon arrival, a Twitter-generated board saying, sorry, that page doesn't exist. In that brief absence, Twitter lit up with controversial uh, theories as to why the account had maybe been shut down, some even suggesting it was suspended due to Trump's past tweets on North Korea. Those theories, however, crumbled when the Twitter government, or the head of Twitter, tweeted this. Earlier today, Donald Trump's account was inadvertently deactivated due to human error by a Twitter employee. The account was down for 11 minutes and has since been restored. We're continuing to investigate and are taking steps to prevent this from happening again. Then just two hours later, Twitter tweeted again, saying, through our investigation, we have learned that this was done by a Twitter customer support employee who did this on his or her last day. We are conducting a full internal interview. And just like that, Trump's account was back in action. The president tweeting this morning, my Twitter account was down for 11 minutes by a rogue employee. I guess the word must finally be getting out and having an impact. And Lois, the president has been very active on Twitter since that suspension. You read some of the tweets a little bit earlier, but he has tweeted seven times this morning alone. Okay, so let's talk a little bit about the reaction here, what people are saying, why this happened. Yeah, you heard a little bit before from the, the guests you were speaking to that this could be a dangerous thing. However, online, people really were uh, making quite the joke of this. A lot of people supporting that, quote, rogue employee. And... Uh, Let's take a look at the tweets because they are just hilarious. Okay, so this one user tweeting, I'm just going to say it. The employee at Twitter who shut off Trump's account for a whole 11 minutes could become a candidate for the Nobel Peace Prize. Another saying, not all heroes wear capes. And this tweet paired with an image of former U.S. President Barack Obama says, a quote, rogue employee deleted Donald Trump's Twitter I think we all know who that was. Now, other than the conspiracy theories and some laughs, Lois, there didn't seem to be too much concern online. However, you did hear that there is the potential that this could cause chaos. Maybe if somebody, if that employee had gone and tweeted something, perhaps uh, antagonizing uh, a country like North Korea. Right, all joking aside, there could have been a bigger impact. Yeah. Jamie, thanks so much.